now. I showed you once, I showed you twice. That Welcome, NBA fans. This is Kevin Frazier here on ESPN. The Wizards come in looking to put on a show for the fans in D.C. Stack plays way above the rim. He rides the same elevator, just gets off on a different floor. They'll go head-to-head -head with the Pistons. Ben Wallace has to be the backbone of the defense. You know, he's one of the best interior defenders in the association. Pistons, Wizards, it's going to be off the hook. Welcome to the new home of the NBA here on ESPN. We're here at the MCI Center in Washington. I'm Bob Fitzgerald along with the tall guy, Tom Tolbert. We're going to take a second to look at the starting lineups, but Tommy, what I really want to know is who are the two key players out there? Fitz, I think we got to pay attention to this fellow. Jerry Stackhouse has got some hops. If he gets airborne, you're going to see some sneaker prints on somebody's back. On the other side, you've got a warrior. Ben Wallace is just solid when it comes to his defensive responsibilities. He always seems to be in the right place at the right time. Thanks, Tom. We're just about ready for the tip to get this one started. And the Pistons get the tip and we're underway. To Wallace. Wallace shoots, and scores the opening Wallace. field goal. No one's going to confuse this guy with an offensive juggernaut, but that doesn't mean you can just take him for granted. To Haywood. Pass caught by Stackhouse. Jerry. The jumper was buried by Stackhouse. When you're the star player, you realize that taking on all the responsibility comes with the territory. The Pistons head into the front court. Caught by Wallace. Phillips goes with the fadeaway. Not there for him. Just couldn't sink that one. And you know he would have loved to drop that mid-range jet. To Arenas. Pass right wing. Stackhouse lets it go from the wing. Looking. You have to hit a few of those mid-range ones like that before the D starts taking you seriously. Just over 11 minutes here in the first quarter. To Prince. Out of the wing. Pump fakes. Hamilton with the crossover. Good looking play Richard coming up here. Hamilton. Arena is at the controls. To Haywood. Arena off the glass. Lays it right in. That was a nice finish there. Arena. The Pistons bring it up court and are two back. To Hamilton. Caught by Billups. He's double teamed. Seven on the shot clock. The J was off the mark by Wallace. Okay. Drained by Okur. You have to be happy with any possession where you end up with a great look. Just over 10 minutes here in the first quarter. To Brown. Brown sails in. Makes it in. He generally doesn't score in bunches, but he'll take his shots when he can. And the Pistons work it up. They're shooting 59% from the floor. To Okur. Seven on the shot clock. Wallace is called for the charge, and that is his first foul of the game. Sometimes you just got to sacrifice your body. But when you draw the charge, it's all worth it. The Wizards bring it up court and are up a deuce. To Jeffries. Pass caught by Stackhouse. Swatted away. And it's right to him. Not that time. He was itching to get a piece of that one. The Pistons have the ball. To Hamilton. Hamilton high off the glass. Richard and it's worthy of a second look. To Stackhouse. Fades. No way, no how. The Pistons touched it last right before it went out of bounds. 
to Arenas. Pump fakes. To Brown. Brown gets vertical. Bricks the windmill jam. Sometimes you visualize everything perfectly, but the ball just won't cooperate with the game plan. To Okur. Now by Okur. Prince fires from 14. Not there for him. Wallace is hacked and will go to the line for a couple. Can't sink the first. Jeffries. Jeffries sinks the basket and gets a trip to the line for one more. He completes the three-point play. And the Pistons are back a bit here. 11 to 8. Lob to Prince. To Okur. Okur fires from the right block. It's ripped down by Hayward. A well-time spin move like this one can get you open every time. Phillips heads up court. To Hamilton. Now right wing. Phillips crosses it over. Fired short by Phillips. A few more feet in, and he would have had a good chance to sink that one. An extra effort rebound by Hamilton. That one just looked a little off when he released it. To Okur. Pump fakes. Hamilton backs up. Wallace, the second chance bucket is missed. Three shots is tripped down before it's cashed in by Okur. You get inside like that, those are gimmies. The Wizards have the ball in a small lead. 13 to 10. To Arenas. Pass to the wing. Stackhouse puts it up from the corner. No good. The Wizards train it and now have a five point lead. Off balance and he still hits it. That's tough. Just under seven minutes here in the first quarter. To Hamilton. Out on the right. Jabs. Phillips crosses over. Phillips high off the glass. Substitution for the Pistons. Sinks the first of two. He gets him both. Arena brings it up, and he's got five assists. To Jeffries. Jeffries puts it up inside. A rare rebound by Prince. That's what the replay is here for. Checking out plays like this. One point separating the teams. to Brown. Brown takes it in, lays it right in. He generally doesn't score in bunches, but he'll take his shots when he can. Just over six minutes here in the first quarter. Hamilton shoots from the post. Rebounded inside by Haywood. Knocked off course, and it's sent out of bounds. Haywood will head to the bench. to Arenas. Leitner is asking for it in the post. Leitner releases. Bounces long and won't fall. Got in close there, but still couldn't seal the deal. The Pistons bring it up. They're shooting 40% from the floor. To Billups. Received by Hamilton. Here comes the double team. The J was missed by Wallace. They sometimes have second thoughts about getting the ball on the inside, and you can see why. 
to Leitner. Leitner goes to the hook. Money on the jump shot. I think he may have went with the hook shot there because he didn't want to get smashed back in his face, and it was the right move. The Pistons have the ball but are trailing 19 to 14 to Hamilton. Pump fakes. To Prince. Five on the shot clock. Shoots the three. Gets the front rim. They're playing him soft on the outside because that's just not this guy's game. Stackhouse takes a turnaround J. An extra effort rebound by Billups. Stackhouse is shooting a low percentage here in the first quarter. And we have a foul. Substitution round. We'll sit down to avoid further foul trouble. Prince will come off the floor. He gets the first of two. He gets them both. The Wizards have it and are up three. To Hughes. Right wing pass. Arena glides in. Watch him use his ball yeah. handling footwork to keep the defender off balance. Now that's how you attack the rim. The Pistons would love to cut into the lead some more with a bucket here. To Sura. Williamson shoots from 13 feet out. Good. Nice basket to keep this one close early on. You don't want to let this game get away from you. The Wizards are at the controls. To Leitner. Leitner with the fadeaway. Misses the jumper. I'm not sure fading away was the right idea that time, especially since he started so close to the rim. The shot in the paint was missed by Sura. His low post game isn't anything to write home about, so it's not surprising to see him clank that one. To Stackhouse. With the jab step. Stackhouse with the crossover. Seven on the shot clock. With the runner. Great shot by the nine-year man out of North Carolina. Sometimes that step back move gives you just enough time to gather yourself for a good release. The Pistons take it up court. They're down five. Dumps it off. Wallace releases. Misses from just inside the line. The shot from the post missed by Williamson. And the Pistons keep shooting blanks here in the first quarter. To Hughes. Pump fakes. Hughes steps back inside. Thomas from inside hits it. Coaches are always happy when players establish the inside game. Just under three minutes here in the first quarter. To Hamilton. On to Williamson. Williamson sails in. That's a play that deserves a second look. The Wizards could add to their lead with a bucket this trip down. To Stackhouse. Stackhouse pulls the trigger from the high post. Rebounded by Hamilton. Grabbed by Sura. Sura crosses it over. The 17-footer is missed by Sura. His mid-range game is on the mediocre side, so he's going to miss his share of those. To Thomas. To Thomas takes a wide-open shot. Not going down. Those are the breaks. Sometimes you do everything right, and they Return still don't go. Hamilton. Take it all the way by Hamilton. That's what you want on offense. High percentage shots. Just under two minutes here in the first quarter. To Hughes. Stackhouse tries the spin move. The runner was buried by Stackhouse. He's shaked and baked with that crossover move. Phillips has the rock. To Hamilton. Wing pass. Jabs. Sura lets it go from the wing. Yes. That's a nifty little combo that kept the D at bay. Looks like the defender wasn't expecting the crossover. The Wizards are holding on to the lead. 27 to 24. Arenas releases from 15. Money on the jump shot. 
He's not really known for his mid-range game, but that is no excuse for the defense to slack off him. The Pistons take it out. They're shooting 40% from the floor. Pump fakes. Wallace fires from the right block. Rebounded inside by Leitner. Received by Thomas. To Hughes. Out on the right. The shot clock shows five. It's blocked, and it's corralled by Leitner. The tough shot is missed by Leitner. You're not used to him getting a hand on the ball like that, but he made a nice block on that one. Watch how a real man does his thing here. Arenas works it up, and he's got seven assists. To Thomas. Thomas is hacked and will go to the line for a couple. Substitutions Arenas the will leave the floor. Hamilton will head to the bench. Substitutions for the Pistons. Can't sink the first. He sinks the second. To Williamson. Campbell wants it down low. Campbell takes flight. A two-handed jam. That's the great thing about being tall. You can dunk whenever you want. Got it off in time, but the buzzer beater was missed by Hughes. We're at the end of one, and it's close. The score, 30 to 28. Stackhouse inbounds to start the second quarter. To Stackhouse. Pass caught by Hayes. To Stackhouse. Now right side. Leitner shoots. Doesn't get it all the way there. He's definitely not shy about putting up those mid-range shots. That miss isn't going to shake his confidence. Well, this all started with the steal. What do you do when you get a turnover? You turn it into offense. And the Pistons work it up court. to Campbell, and that's his first takeaway of the game. They're running. Hughes slides in. Tries to drop it in, but it won't go. Off the front rim and missed by Stackhouse. You want the ball in the hands of your best players. If they miss, they miss. The three-pointer dropped in by Sura. Tough shot. The defender was draped all over him. One point separating the teams to Hayes. Pass right wing. Stackhouse lets it go from the wing. Not there for him. Just couldn't sink that one. And you know he would have loved to drop that mid-range J. Williamson sails in. Takes the lead. Hughes has the ball. To Thomas. He's double teamed. Count that last jumper by Thomas. Gets his feet set and knocks down the shorty. The Pistons work it up. They're shooting 45% from the floor. To Sura. Outside. To Williamson. Six seconds to shoot. <clears throat> Williamson with the charge, and that will be his second foul of the game. How about perfect defensive read. He was set. He knew he was going to get blasted, and he stood his ground. Shoots from 12. Great play. Let's see that one from a different angle. The Pistons have the ball in a small deficit. 36 to 33. Grabbed by Williamson. Skip to Williamson. Seven on the shot clock. Williamson now is in double figures. He juked his defender with that crossover, and it was pretty easy to get to the goal after that. The Wizards have it. 
Hayes releases from the stripe. No worries. He definitely took a big gamble with the mid-range shot, but it paid off. Just over nine minutes here in the second quarter. Back to Hunter. To Williamson. Campbell is calling for it. Picked off. Oh, nice job by the D getting a hand in there. That was a foolhardy pass in traffic. To Stackhouse. Hayes uses the drop step. One-handed dunk was stuffed down by Hayes. He went with the one hand and flushed it down. And the Pistons with control but are down here. 40 to 35. Campbell takes a quick shot. Controlled by Leitner. To Stackhouse. Skip to Leitner. Seven on the shot clock. Rebounded by Campbell. That's just right around the spot where they stop being gimmies, and you gotta concentrate to knock them down. To Wallace. Wallace shoots from the post. That was an excellent play. Watch the job he does here. To Leitner. With the shot, couldn't connect off the drive. It's easy to get a little distracted once you start the crossover. I think that's what threw him off. The favorable bounce helped that long shot by Williamson. The pace from the first quarter is carrying right on over into the second quarter. Neither team is letting up. The Wizards have the ball in a one-point lead. To Leitner. Pump fakes. He's doubled up. Thomas puts it up inside, hits it. No one's going to confuse this guy with an offensive juggernaut, but that doesn't mean you can just take him for granted. Just over seven minutes here in the second quarter. Hunter lets it go from the wing. A rare rebound by Hayes. To Stackhouse. Hayes goes to the drop step. Tried to connect on the fadeaway, but it was no good by Hayes. He was smart to try the fadeaway to get himself some room. He just couldn't get it to go. To Hunter. Wallace fires from 14. Wallace. Automatic. You got to give him credit. He turned a bad-looking shot into two points. The Wizards have the ball in a small lead. 42 to 41. To Thomas. Thomas shoots from the post. Nice rebound by the 14-year man out of Clemson. Wallace releases, can't finish it in the post. Yet another block, and that's his first block of the game. He had that block all the way. To Hayes, out on the left wing. Stackhouse takes a turnaround J. No, sir. I normally like the turnaround J, but I'm not sure he needed to go to it that time. To Wallace. Man. Check out this unreal assist. Now that's what made the play work. Just under six minutes here in the second quarter. To Stackhouse. Stackhouse takes it in. Goes back to the lane. He has a little quickness advantage on this man, and he exploited it. The Pistons have the ball and are down one. To Sura. Received by Williamson. Williamson commits the charge, and that is his third foul so far. So Portland Williamson picks up a costly foul, Fitz. His team is already in the hole, so it'll be interesting to see how he responds in the second half. Williamson will come out of the game because of foul trouble. Arena brings it up, and he's got seven assists. Brown glides in, swatted away. Lindsey Hunter. And the Wizards take it up. They're shooting 44% from the floor. Sura made the nab back there, records his first steal. To Prince, it's one thing to strip the ball. It's another just to snatch it like he did. Fired long by Prince. That's going to leave a sour taste in the coach's mouth. He's not out there to take those mid-range Jays, and he knows it. A rare rebound by Sura. To Sura. Now left side. Sura shoots from just inside the line. 
Ripped down inside by Haywood. To Haywood. Pass caught by Brown. Brown uses the drop step. The J was missed by Brown. He's got to think twice before he takes that shot. And if he still wants to shoot it, how about thinking thrice? The worse you are at shot blocking, the more likely you are to commit the foul. That's why maybe you should think about, I don't know, staying on the floor. Sinks the first of two. He gets them both. Three-point spread on the scoreboard. To Jeffries. Jeffries goes with the runner. Nice tip right there. It's better just to tip it in and then grab it and bring it down where some little guy can run around in there and strip it from you. And the Pistons head into the front court. To Sura. Lob to Okur. He's doubled up. Prince launches from beyond the arc. No good from three-point land. Hey, look, just because you can nail those in practice doesn't mean you should be taking them in the game. The dunk was just crushed in by Brown. To Campbell. Dumps it off. He's double-teamed. Prince sails in. Hunter with the great feed picks up his sixth assist. Arenas brings it up. To Brown. Brown fades away inside. Misses the jumper. When you get inside and come away empty, you're always a little wow. angry at yourself. Sura. Or a lot angry at yourself. Off the glass and in by Sura. To Hayes. Out on the left. For three doesn't get the long one. They were playing him to drive the whole way because they don't respect this guy's perimeter game. Puncher releases from the stripe. Money on the jump shot. You knew that was good as soon as he released it. The Wizards have it but are behind. 53 to 48. Hayes. Once he got inside on this one, there was no doubt about it. You better run for cover. The Pistons bring it up. They're shooting 33% from beyond the arc. To Campbell. Campbell takes a quick shot. Not this time. Haywood swatted that one away, and it's his first block of the game. To Brown. Knocked off course, and it's loose inside. Campbell got his hand on that shot and blocked it out of bounds. Campbell looks fresh coming back on the floor. To Arenas. Caught by Jeffries. Jeffries shoots. He's off from three-point lane. You want your best shooters out there on the perimeter taking those shots, not the guys who can't hit him with their lives dependent on him. Runter. Crossed over on the way to the hoop and then drained by Hamilton. Without that crossover, he would not have been able to get off that jump shot. Arenas takes it up, and he's got eight assists. To Brown. Brown from the left block. Brown, 10 points by the third-year man out of Glen Academy High School. To Campbell. To Prince. Here comes the double team. Okor shoots from the paint. Controlled by Haywood. Big bucket by the third-year man out of Glen Academy High School. He had all day to think about that one. That's just too easy. And the Pistons work it up. They're shooting 47% from the floor. To Billups. Pass to the wing. The tough shot. If NBA plays are anything, it's confident. I'm not sure that was the best shot, but he takes it and makes it. Arenas with an assist here. He'll have 10 assists on the night. Arenas double clutches. Gets the lay -in. You've got to keep your eye on this guy. He's always looking for your weakness, and when he finds it, he will exploit it. 
51 seconds here in the second quarter. To Campbell. Lob to Prince. Prince goes to the drop step. That last 13 footer was on the mark by Prince. The Pistons are lighting up the twine today. If they can keep this up, they should be able to pull away. Arenas with a bucket here. He can get his 10th point of the game. Off the right rim and in by Hayes. Jarvis Hayes is doing everything he can to keep his team in the game, Fitz. 26 seconds here in the second quarter. To Hamilton. He's double teamed. Campbell is pummeled and will have an opportunity to get two from the line. Brown will sit down to avoid further foul trouble. He gives them the lead. He gets them both. Fifteen seconds here in the second quarter. Arena uses the glass. It's rejected. A rare rebound by Prince. The clock runs out and we're heading to halftime. The score, 61 to 59. Now that we have a little breather, Tom is going to give us the stat breakdown with Game Track. Take it, Tommy. Thanks, Fitz. The Pistons have the rebounding edge here at half, but they're going to need to work just as hard on the boards in the second half. That'll do it for Game Track for now. We'll check in to see how it all played out on the storyline at the end of the game. Stackhouse inbounds to start the second half. To Hayes. Here comes the double team. Brown is hacked on the way up, and he'll get two shots at the foul line. He can't get the first. He misses them both. Ripped down inside by Okur. To Okur. Pump fakes. With the runner. Talk about urging the replay. This one's definitely worth another look see. Arenas works it up. He's shooting 66% from the floor to Arenas. Grabbed by Stackhouse. Haywood shoots from the post. Money. This is one of those guys they don't want a lot of plays for, but I'll tell you how he gets his points, by getting out there, constant movement, and always hustling. The Pistons have the lead here, 63 to 61. Now by Prince. Seven on the shot clock. Tricky fadeaway shot is off the mark by Hamilton. He tried the fadeaway to get it over the defender, but he couldn't sink it. To Hayes. Hayes with a crossover. Hayes is called for the charge, and that is his first foul of the game. Fits the defender had position all the way on that one. You just can't bowl over people like that. Stackhouse will head to the bench. The Pistons work it up court. To Prince. Prince goes to the hook. And the Pistons will turn it over. Substitution for the Wizards. Arenas is just one basket away from a double double on the night. Fades. Hits it. This guy's a smart player. Instead of trying to go straight up over the taller defender, he fades a little bit, and that's how he gets his separation. Phillips has the rock. To Hamilton. Hamilton sails in. The tip in is missed. Those are the breaks. Sometimes you do everything right and they still don't go. To Haywood. Now outside. Arena shoots from the top of the key. Rebounded inside by Billups. To Prince. Pass caught by Okur. To Billups. Seven on the shot clock. Pass right side. 
Phillips launches from beyond the arc. John I dug this play in real time. I'm digging it even more in the replay. Arena works it up, and he's got 10 points. Lob to Jeffries. Caught by Jeffries. Nice alley-oop, but it wasn't finished by Jeffries. Taking the length of the court, but missed by Hamilton. Most players have the advantage when they go inside. He's one of those guys who just always seems to have trouble in there. To Jeffries. He's held up. Went with the lay-in, but it was missed by Haywood. They call these things freebies for a reason, because usually they are, but in this case, it wasn't. To Hamilton. Hamilton steps back. Pump fakes from downtown. John gets nothing but net. The Pistons have gone to the bench today, Fitz, and they have come up big time for this team. And the Wizards with the ball, and they trail by six. To Jeffries. Wallace was parked down low and got hit with a three-second call. He gets it to fall. Skip to Arenas, to Haywood. Stackhouse crosses over. Five on the shot clock. The layup is dropped in by Stackhouse. You can't shy away from the spotlight when you're a star, Fitz, and this guy certainly doesn't. Just over eight minutes here in the third quarter. To Wallace. Wallace pops it up from 19 and feet. Wallace. That's a play that deserves a second look. It's a five-point game. To Jeffries. Brown takes the quick shot. Gets the bucket. He got in prime scoring position right there and got the job done. Just under eight minutes here in the third quarter. To Hamilton. Hamilton goes with the runner. Misses the jumper. Got his own rebound and then drained by Hamilton. The hook shot is such a weapon. It's surprising so few players use it, Fitz. The Wizards take it out. They're shooting 25% from beyond the arc. Jeffries gets airborne. Swatted. The Wizards will get this one back. To Jeffries. Grabbed by Haywood. Arenas goes with the crossover. The layup is banked in by Arenas. The Wizards are pounding it inside, play after play. The defense is as soft as the underside of a turtle. Phillips has an opportunity to get his third three of the night this trip down. Pump fakes. Hamilton lets it go from the wing. Nice rebound by the third-year man out of Glen Academy High School. Slams it through. That's what's so great about working it inside. You come away with high percentage shots. Just under seven minutes here in the third quarter. Received by Wallace. Phillips releases off target from 15. If that's the best shot they can come up with for a possession, you know it wasn't a good set. To Stackhouse. Stackhouse pops it up for nine. Sometimes it's just a matter of creating a little space. He used the drive to free himself up and knock that jumper down. And the Pistons are just behind here. 74 to 73. To Wallace. Caught by Wallace. Just stopped the drought. Misfired. He loves that shot. And a miss isn't going to change his mind. To Jeffries. Lob to Stackhouse. Stackhouse pulls the trigger from the high post. Hits it. That 10 to 14 footer can be more difficult than it looks sometimes. Nice follow through. Just under six minutes here in the third quarter. Phillips launches from beyond the arc. Ten rebounds by the third year man out of North Carolina. Drops right in. He is hard to shut down when you get inside like that. The Pistons take it up court and they've nailed their last three shots from beyond the arc. Now by Prince. Grabbed by Hamilton. With a jab step. 
Hamilton crosses it over. Kwame Brown finishes off a double-double, but he's still got to worry about the game because it's tight. Just over five minutes here in the third quarter. The inside of that one was off the mark by Jeffries. Jerry Stackhouse drains number 23. Phillips brings it up. He's shooting 66% from beyond the arc. Dumps it off. Here comes the double team. Two in the drought. Misses the jumper. Wallace is pummeled and will have an opportunity to get two from the line. Leitner coming back in after sitting on the bench for a while. Okor will come off the floor. He gets the first of two. He gets them both. Over five minutes here in the third quarter. To Leitner. Brown lifts off. Powers this one down and out. To Campbell. Prince takes a wide open shot. No one's home. Campbell is hacked on the way up. And he'll get two shots from the line instead. Sinks the first of two. He gets them both. The Wizards have it, and the run is 12-4. To Jeffries. It's stolen! Protecting the ball is priority number one. You can start thinking ahead and lose track of the handle. He's double teamed, splits it with a pass. There That's what the replay is here for. Checking out plays like this. Just over four minutes here in the third quarter. To Leitner. He's doubled up. Deflected, and it's sent out of bounds. Jeffries will leave the floor. He's really been struggling so far. to Arenas. Received by Leitner. Pump fakes. Six seconds to shoot. Hayes shoots with the clock winding down. Brown, 16 points by the third year man out of Glenn Academy High School. Phillips brings it up and he's got seven assists. To Campbell. Campbell fires from the right block. Big bucket by the 14-year man out of Clemson. Great adjustment at half, Mitch. This looks like a whole different ball club out here. To Leitner. Stackhouse with a crossover. Five on the shot clock. Crossed over, but not converted by Stackhouse. Gets his sixth point of the period. He's got 18 total. Just under three minutes here in the third quarter. To Prince. Pass left wing. Hamilton with the crossover. Hamilton takes the shot from the elbow. All down by Brown. Hamilton might want to slow it down a little here in the third quarter. Back to Stackhouse. To Arenas. Jab steps. Bat it away! The Pistons can't hit their shots here in the third quarter. Pass caught by Stackhouse. Talk about earning a replay. This one's definitely worth another look see. The Pistons can cut into the lead with a basket here. To Hamilton. They push it inside. To Campbell uses the drop step. The J was off the mark by Campbell. Those are free throws for most players in practice. It's a much tougher shot when the real game starts. To Leitner. Leitner fades away inside. A rare rebound by Billups. To Hamilton. Hamilton takes it to the rim, makes it off the drive in the lane. He shaked and baked with that crossover move. The Wizards have it and are up three. To Brown. 
Pass caught by Arenas. Lob to Hayes. Hayes gets up. One hands it through. He went with the one hand and flushed it down. Just over a minute here in the third quarter. To Hamilton. Out of the wing. Pump fakes. Billups takes it in. Denied. And it's right to him. The Wizards would love to extend their lead this trip down. To Leitner. Leitner from the left block. Money on the jump shot. If you're expecting him to miss wide open shots like that, you may want to rethink your strategy. And the Pistons bring it up. They're shooting 43% from the floor. And Wallace and leaps up. Wallace. Watch him hammer this one down. That is all about power. The Wizards have the lead here. 90-85. Hayes goes up. Hammered, and he'll go to the line. Brown will come off the floor. Williamson looks fresh coming back on the floor. Sinks the first of two. He gets them both. And the Pistons have the ball. To Sura. Sura goes glass. Swatted away. He can't get the first. Good on number two. 17 seconds here in the third quarter. To Leitner. Hayes from inside. Not a doubt. In the right situation, he can get the inside shot he wants, Fitz. And that was the right situation. To Campbell. Campbell unloads from deep, deep three-point range. No way. We're at the end of the third quarter with the score 94-86. Williamson inbounds to start the final quarter. To Sura. Caught by Hunter. Sura glides in. Deflected. The Pistons were the last ones to get a piece of it before it heads out of bounds. Hughes is at the controls. Now by Hayes. Dumps it off. For a double digit lead. Ripped down inside by Campbell. Hunter off the glass. That was an Let excellent play. Hunter. Watch the job he does here. It's a six point game. To Leitner. Sends it back the other way. And it's controlled by Hayes. Hayes shoots from the post. Money on the jump shot. If you want to make life difficult for him, you better start off with pushing him out further from the bucket. Here in the fourth quarter. Hunter raises up. Gets the front rim. That one just looked a little off when he released it. The Wizards bring it up. They're shooting 25% from beyond the arc. To White. They work it in. White uses the drop step. To Hughes. Five on the shot clock. Top of the stripe shot was no good by Hughes. He gets the first of two. He gets them both. 
The Pistons with control, but are down here. 98 to 88. To Sura. Right wing pass. Pump fakes. To cut it to single digits. Not there for him. You gotta knock down those little 69 footers, Fitz. Received by Leitner. In the paint. To Hayes. Tosses it back out. Stack out. Puts it up from 11. Off the mark. Great scores never met a shot they didn't like. I'm sure that miss is not going to slow him down. Sura lets it go from the wing. Nice defensive rebound by Leitner. Swatted. That shot didn't have a prayer. The home defense came over at just the right time to make the play. To Leitner. Hughes glides in, deflected, and that's his fifth block of the contest. I've got a good idea. Stop trying to test that man. He is killing him out there. Wallace takes off, and we have a foul. This drive is taking them right out of the game. It's going to be very, very difficult to catch up. He can't get the first. on number two. Hughes takes it up. He's shooting 33% from the floor. To White for a double-digit lead. Nice rebound by the 14-year man out of Clemson. To Sura. Grabbed by Wallace. Williamson fired from the post, gets the bucket. The Pistons bench is doing its part, fit, but they need the starters to step up and help make a game out of this. Hayes sails in, puts too much on it. Hayes is hacked and will go to the line for a couple. Sinks the first of two. He's off on the second. It's ripped down by Wallace to Sura. Sura takes it in with the denial. And it's right back to the shooter. To Hunter. Skip to Sura. Pass low post. Wallace shoots from the Man. post. So nice. We got to look at it twice. And the Wizards could add to their lead with a bucket this trip down. To Hayes. Pump fake. Pass caught by Leitner. Rebounded inside by Campbell. They can't hit anything right now. They need to shake it up out there. Call it T.O., get a new lineup, anything to break this streak. Caught by Campbell. Jabs. Sura shoots. Missed it from the wing. A few more feet in, and he would have had a good chance to sink that one. The land was cashed in by Hughes. So many players just force up horrible shots. It's nice to see a player work the ball around to the open man. The Pistons are down eight, but they have the ball. The shot from beyond the arc was missed by Sura. Look that pass shot by Campbell. Every shooter would obviously love to square the shoulders and the feet before each shot, but sometimes you have to take what the D gives you, and this time it was a leaner. The Wizards work it up. They're shooting 45% from the floor. And that's his first takeaway of the game. Great anticipation. He knew that pass was going inside, and he was right there to pick it. To Williamson. Williamson shoots from 12. Ripped down inside by Leitner. And the Pistons keep shooting blanks here in the fourth quarter. Grabbed by Stackhouse. White takes it in. Drops it in on the way. Beautiful feed inside for the score. That was the only place he could put the ball. The Pistons bring it up, and they've hit their last two shots from beyond the arc. To Campbell. Pass left side. Seven on the shot clock. Sura shoots. Can't score after the crossover. He's really off right now, Fitz. He just can't get anything to fall. Couldn't push the lead to double digits. That shot was missed by Hayes. That's called working through the highlight reel. And here it comes.
Hunter takes it up, and he's got seven assists. Desura. Skip to Hunter. Clock down to six. Hunter shoots with the clock winding down. Makes the long distance connection. Whoa, that was a heck of a shot right there. The defense did everything they could. Hughes fires from 14. It's good. This is when you want to have a lead here in the fourth quarter. Make the other team start sweating. Sura hasn't had a good game so far. He's going to sit down for a while. Hunter brings it up, and he's got 11 points. To Hamilton. Now by Wallace. Received by Campbell. Seven on the shot clock. To Hamilton. Long range. Can't drop it in from beyond the arc. You don't see that often, but some elevation there by Campbell. Dunks don't have to be flashy. They just have to go down. Arena on this trip can get assist number 15. To Hayes. Lob to Leitner. Leitner uses the drop step. Rejected hard. Deflects the pass. The Wizard regain control. Wing shot is missed by Leitner. To Wallace. Pass caught by Hunter. Hunter takes it to the rim. One more time. Check this out. The Wizards have the ball in the lead. 107 to 102. Hamilton made the nab back there and records his first steal. To Campbell. Now on the wing. Williamson releases from close range. 11 rebounds by the 12 year man out of Duke. With the crossover, the outside fadeaway was canned by Stackhouse. The Wizards, they're just like sharks on the inside today, and they smell blood. Just over four minutes here in the fourth quarter. Hunter fires on the right Hunter. block. Hunter, 13 points by the 11-year man out of Jackson State. Arena lets it go from the wing. Not there for him. Just couldn't sink that one, and you know he would have loved to drop that mid-range jam. Hayes made the nab back there, records his first steal. Dumps it off. Leitner takes a shot from the elbow. Wasn't there. They're going to need to send out a search party to find out where this guy's offense is fits. It's been MIA this entire quarter. The outside fadeaway was no good by Campbell. To White. White from the left block. Great shot by the third-year man out of Arizona. That's why you don't quit on the boards, Fitz. Just over three minutes here in the fourth quarter. To Williamson. Now by Hamilton. It's hard to believe, but this one looks even better the second time. Just under three minutes here in the fourth quarter. To Stackhouse. Out of the right wing. To Stackhouse. Stackhouse is called for charging, and that'll be his second foul of the game. Takes a defender had position all the way on that one. He just can't fall over people like that. Campbell will leave the floor. Substitution for the Pistons. To Wallace. Wallace gets airborne. He gets hammered. And he'll head to the strike. He gets the first of two. He's off on the second. It's ripped down by Brown. To Stackhouse. Right side pass. To Brown. 
Brown takes the turnaround, Jay. Controlled by Wallace. Lays it right in. These two teams have been battling all game, Fitz, and it may be decided right here in the fourth quarter. Just over two minutes here in the fourth quarter to Stackhouse. Stackhouse takes the shot, gets his sixth point of the period. He has a total of 31. Stack drops in another one, and if he continues to roll like this, he just might be the difference. Just under two minutes here in the fourth quarter. Caught by Prince. Bounce to Prince. To Hamilton. Dumps it off. Seven on the shot clock. Fired long by Wallace. He just had no hope on that play. That's not his shot, and the defense wasn't having any of it. Arena glides in. Knocked off course. To Billups. Billups takes a shot from about 16. We gotta take a look at this one again. It's all about making plays. The Wizards are holding on to the lead. 113 to 111. Grabbed by Stackhouse. Wallace got his hand on that shot and blocked it out of bounds. Rejected hard, and it's right to him. Nice. He was a human fly spotter on that one. He sent that one flying. Knocked off course. And that's his second block of the game. Nothing feels better than bringing the heat at the last second and swatting the ball away. And I should know, I was a monster shot blocker during my playing career. Not. 49 seconds here in the game. Tubs it off. Time and the Pistons will take a timeout here. To Prince. Wing pass. For the tie. Rebounded inside by Haywood. Timeout, Wizards. Pump fakes to Haywood. Received by Haywood. The wide open bucket was missed by Haywood. They have it within striking timeout distance, Pistons. but it's still anybody's ball game. And the Pistons take their last timeout. To Billups to take the lead. No dice from long range. Hamilton with the personal. That'll be his second foul of the game. Time and the Wizards, Wizards will take their very last time out. Chauncey Billups with the personal. That's his first foul of the game. He gets the first of two. He's off on the second. An extra effort rebound by O'Cool. He made it. That was a big shot to force overtime by Billups. That's the end of the ball game. It was a tight one. Your final score is 114 to 111. That was a great matchup we just watched. Let's check the storyline with Tom Tolbert. Tommy, take it away. Thanks, hey, Fitz. The Wizards didn't settle for jump shots today. They knew they had the advantage on the inside, and they took it down there and just worked this team over. Thanks for the storyline, Tom. We also don't want to forget the MVP. Stackhouse is our ESPN player of the game, and he finishes with a total of 31 points and 8 rebounds. For Tom Tolbert, this is Bob Fitzgerald saying so long, and thanks for watching ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports.